Facebook News, and um, I'm here still at IDF 2012 at the HTML5 booth, and uh, Info is showcasing a bunch of really, really cool stuff. Um, you can see the first thing is here, and I'm waving, is a, a video conferencing system that is running entirely in the browser. It is extremely smooth. I think it, I mean, I'm not really sure, but it does look to be even smoother than Google Hangouts um, or Skype or anything, really. It's, it's just running like a native app. Uh, over here is the, is the second device, you can, you can see it here. And uh, here I am again. Pretty neat. <laughs> over here, we have something different. You can uh, see it here. You have a, a remote control, and it's just a complete media center that is running on uh, HTML5 in the browser. It's, uh, it's completely, it, it feels like a native app that's the that's the impressive part it is really really hang on let me see if I can get uh, some something going on here and click on go and it's playing in the browser it should be okay it's not go ahead okay the Disney video doesn't work okay. Oh yeah, watch, put the TV in. So it does TV, it does, it does picture, it does everything. And I, I did see a video before, so I can, I can con confirm that it does, really does work. But yeah, it's, it's okay, I saw it. <laughs> if I move over here, this is probably my, my, my favorite bit. We have this here on a, on a tablet, but even more um, maybe interesting is here one of the reference designs, uh, Ultra Books with Touch. This is still an Intel reference design. You can see it there, there's the Intel uh, logo. And this is one of those new uh, iBook-like uh, education experience is probably what they call it. Um, and it's extremely interactive, but the, really the cool thing is it feels like a native app. It does not feel like you're running this in the browser. You can see, you can, you can, you can do all kinds of things. Um, if I go back, I can even do, um, hang on. It is running extremely well, I'm, I'm, I'm not kidding you. There is, there is video, uh, and it's all on the browser. There's, there's, there's music, of course. Oh, that was, but you see what I mean. It's, it's incredibly fluid. It's, it, it feels like a native app. They also have um, some comparison here. This is uh, something called Field Run. It's one of the uh, Tower Defense games. And it's running here incredibly smoothly, of course, on the Intel architecture. And right next to it, we have it the same game, same settings, same everything, on the Tegra 3. So on the um, Asus Transformer Prime. And it's choppy and uh, it's. It's probably true that, that Intel is doing great work with uh, HTML5 uh, optimization. And here you can see this is also really cool. Uh, it's HTML5 1080p in the browser. Let's see if I go back. Hang on. If it works. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, crap. And how do I get back? But yeah, you see it is in the browser and uh, it, it is working. So. Uh, Let me do this. Yeah. So. So he's going to show me again. Yeah. The there it is, yeah. See, and it is 1080p and it is running in the browser. So it is it is really impressive. And uh, we'll see much more from Intel in the HTML5 regard because they seem to be really good at it. That was Paul from Thanks for watching.